Do you know how like if there's someone you really like, you like the smell of them? Yes. I'm the same with my dog. Okay. Do oh. you have any dogs? What? Yeah. Oh yeah, I do that every Wednesday and a Saturday. Totally normal thing. Hello, my dog smelling enthusiasts. Oh, you're a cat smelling enthusiast. Okay, sorry for that. Welcome to another episode of uh, The Button. Prepare for the cringe. Welcome to The Button, a speed dating show. When the button lights up red, either player may press it and swap out their date for a new person. When the button turns red, destruction unfolds. Somebody gets rejected. If two people can last on a date for 10 minutes, Never they win an all expenses paid second date. This is The Button. Let's see if we're gonna find real love today, or just a bunch of uh, cringe interactions. Hello. Hi. I like your shirt. Oh, thank you very yeah. much. I appreciate it. Did you get it like a thrift store or something? Oh yeah, I got it from one of my friends. Yeah. Nice. Trey makes 1,000 plus tortillas a day. Okay. I do make a lot of tortillas every day. For like work or? Yeah. That's how for... I make my money. Yeah, obviously. Imagine if he's such a tortilla enthusiast that uh, he just makes them as a hobby. A thousand a day. If that's you, definitely turn it into a business. Yeah, that's kind of what I do. I grew up eating a lot of Mexican food, so... Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Like, Instant yeah, match. Right? Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. if you're hanging out with me, you can get fresh tortillas anytime. Nice. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, that wink. Oof. Oh, my dude. Uh, is that like an eye twitch? It, was that an eye twitch? That is my question. Some people have like a nervous, you, you know, tick. Or was this a very cringy attempt at uh, flirting? Hanging out with me, you can get fresh tortillas anytime. Nice. <laughs> not a, too big of a fan of tortillas yeah. then, yeah. No. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> can I get the f*** out of here? I want the, uh... Sure. Yeah, sounds good. Oh. Alright, our boy here is getting the f*** out of here. Uh, he is definitely angry. You know, that is a pretty good, uh, I, I guess, pickup line or whatever term you want to use, uh, but the wink ruined everything. What? So fast. No so fast. So fast. Hello. I'm Abby. I'm Cody. Nice, nice to meet you. you. What do you do for, like, your hobbies? I'm really into K-pop. K-pop? <laughs> so I go to K-pop concerts. Nice, nice. Yeah. Like BTS? Oh, yeah. Black sure. Abby hates feet. Why do you hate feet? Um, she hates feet so much she amputated both of her feet. No, I'm not insane. Thanks for asking. I just think they're really gross. <laughs> Can you show her your feet? Do you want me to show you my feet? <laughs> yes, please. Uh, I'm guessing her ex had a foot fetish and she didn't like it. Yes, please. Why would you do that? Oh, nice. Confusion. Confusion. Cool. How do we feel about the feet? Um. Um. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, don't blame you. I'm not a big fan of feet, especially uh, For sure. a big climber, so my climbing shoes get kind of mm. rough. Oh. Yeah, but what's a normal Sunday for you? I get up, climb, and lately we've been doing a lot of barbecues. Okay. Why did you reject me? Oh, um, I'm just not really like an outdoorsy person, but you, yeah, you're really No worries. Awesome. Yeah, nice you know? yeah, you. you're so nice. Yeah, I guess she doesn't like this uh, ultra manly man climbing barbecue, you know what I'm saying? No, every girl likes that, uh, that's fine. All right. I, I don't understand this uh, primal, you know, energy. It's like some type of man cave. Uh, they're out there to get her, you know, you want to kick her out of the show. I, I don't get that. How you doing? I'm good. Yeah. How are you? Good. What makes you horny? Sorry. Ooh. What makes you horny? The, the button is gonna ruin everything. Uh, super inappropriate question for first time seeing someone. Imagine if he says feet. It's over. Is he horny? I don't know. This is weird. I'm an ass man. Mm -hmm. is that, oh. Is that weird to say? Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this is gonna sound hell hella whack, but none of the guys have got to press the button yet. Oh, okay. So our boy is an ass man and uh, he came to press the button for the boys. And no, I don't think that's weird to say. What I think is weird is when the button instantly asks what makes you horny. The button is just setting them up. Oh, we're whispering here. Okay, 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 we're whispering, whispering, whispering. Still whispering. 
my theory is he's not into white women. I don't know that for sure, but uh, interesting theory. I don't think anybody mentioned skin color, but okay. Probably a wrong theory. Carrick, nice to meet you. Carrick? Yeah. Nice to meet you. Okay. I have a fact about Julie. She was banned from Hinge. Banned from Hinge? Hinge? What did you do? I was unhinged, unhinged, and... Uh she was unhinged on hinge never press the button on her i'm just kidding but a uh, great uh, sense of humor i guess and oh shit I would fire your back to anybody that would make too early of a sexual <laughs> uh huh why'd you reject me um i feel like we were vibing more than the last girl but like still kind of wasn't like, i see there, okay mm -hmm. thank you but you're dope nice to meet you nice to meet you i got banned off tinder so i guess we had that in common <laughs> Right, so uh, they have a, a lot in common, actually, but uh, it's always the vibe's fault. Damn you, vibe. We, we get some discrimination against uh, trucker hats. It's not okay. Jasmine. Jasmine. Yeah, nice I like your you. earrings. Thank you. And same we have the same, same cool earrings. Yeah, true. Mine's a little bigger, but... Jasmine likes nerdy frat guys. Nerdy frat All right. guys. Alright. What is a nerdy frat guy? Isn't that a contradiction? That must be a pretty cool uh, character. That's not me. What are you? How do you describe <laughs> yourself? Um, I don't know. Yeah, Why'd he's... you reject me? Was it was it because I rejected the, the last two? No, I'm not. Shit, huh? No, I'm not petty like that. But shit. maybe a little bit. That's alright. But like, like that. it's a it's trucker okay. head. It's okay. No, it's alright. You seem like a cool person though. Yeah, you too. Yeah. Trucker <laughs> head discrimination. Hey, Danny, I like your sweater. Thank you. It felt like the right day to wear this sweater. Yeah. This is my first time wearing it. Talk about this thing that you humans call God. Okay. Oh. I don't necessarily say that I'm. Christian, just because religion mm -hmm. is really hard for me because sure. Christianity has hurt a lot of people. Yeah, yeah, I got so it. I still struggle with that, um, but I do have um, a really relationship okay. with Jesus. I was a youth pastor for like three months okay. at 21. Right. We did like this promo video for the kids, like this like rap Christian video, and I did it. And, and oh, crazy. what? Fa okay, fashion wise, I, the, the Kraken hat doesn't go with the sweater. Uh, Jesus would not approve of this shallow behavior. I don't know. I don't know. They're literally vibing, talking about God, Jesus. Th that's what they are into. And uh, no, no, it's the damn fashion. Which like sounds does. really bad. It and does, I'm, I'm not basing this off. She don't know what she's talking about. It does. Trust me. It's like it just to no, me, no, it doesn't it work. It works. Subjective. Subjective. What's your biggest hobby? Biggest hobby? DJ. Okay. DJ. Jasmine is into clubbing. Are you into That's clubbing? True. Come on. I do love to go out. Really? Okay. Uh, this is too good to be true. DJing and clubbing. No way. Can you two show me your best club oh. dancing? <laughs> Let's oh, go. Is that like the Rasputin? Oh, no. Nope. What is that? You no, know, I know nothing about that. Yeah. Why did you reject me? Okay. The dance moves. Like, no. I just. I got secondhand embarrassment. I'm not gonna lie. I'm sorry. That's okay. I thought his dance moves were fucking dope. Say oh, it. Nice Say it, button. I don't know. I'm starting to like the button. Probably because I listen to it a lot and I'm just like, uh, I'm so used to the voice. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. What kind of vibe are you looking for? I don't know. Someone who's like easygoing and having fun. You seem cool, but I want somebody that knows what they want. You know, and the whole like, you know, I don't know my vibe, kind of a little bit of a red flag for me. Okay. Sorry. You, you, sh she spoke for three seconds. You didn't even give her the time to show her vibe. This was just a stereotypical rejection line uh, he's heard somewhere else. Uh, he's just randomly using it. There is no way he actually meant it. What do you do for work? Um, so I'm a patient access representative, and then I'm also a nursing student, and I'm going to be a nurse tech soon. All okay, right. How about you? Uh, I work at the Department of Licensing. I just work in customer relations, so basically just handle, um, you know, people's records and stuff like that. I, I feel like she's going to reject him. I don't know why. Can you ask him what his turn-ons are? Again. What are your turn-ons? Again. Um, I think, like, turn-on-wise, I am big on, like... I'm a, uh, my love language is physical. Okay. So, like, turn-ons-wise, I don't know. I, I, it's hard to describe. It's one of those, like... Uh... 
you know, like anything in this area, I guess. Yeah. Oh, okay, like not, okay, not okay. like not like porn star status, not uh, like that, uh, but like I wasn't thinking what? of porn star, but now <laughs> I'm thinking like of that. porn star. <laughs> yeah. What about you? I just like when somebody kind of does like words of affirmation. No, yeah, I totally that's my get kind that. You know, kind of like they're reaffirming the reaffirmation. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Don't know how to talk he he's blushing. He's confused. He can't talk. He totally lost his cool. I can see why. We got a nurse over here, you might need to help him when he collapses any moment now. I'm so sorry to pause, but we need to fix something. Really? Oh no. What's going on? <laughs> Do you the button find broke. Brian attractive? What? <laughs> Are you asking me? Yeah. Kind of do. What? You get the strut going, you know? You got that going. <laughs> Hey, what's up? I'm Rosia. <laughs> oh my nice god. <laughs> I'll just bow out. <laughs> they are sabotaging uh, this dude's date with uh, the button technician, Brian. Brian's being a Chad, fixing things with his hands, you know? Damn you, Brian. It worked. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Was that you testing it? Yeah, but testing rejection? and rejection. All right. <laughs> I feel so bad. He was given like that kid in high school who was like super sweet and then you never wanted to reject him and they come over to you and they're like, will you date me? No. Or maybe I only had that experience. Okay. Like okay. Boys. Yeah, I do like bad boys. Hi. <laughs> bad boys like Brian. Uh, thumbs up if Brian needs to come in here now. You like what now? I like bad boys. What makes you think I'm a bad boy? I didn't say that. <laughs> nah, it's okay. What's your name? Razia, what's your name? Jason. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. All right. Are you a bad boy? I'm a wholesome person. How about that? Mm. You sound so toxic. I'm, I'm not toxic at all. I'm a wholesome person. I am wholesome. So I'm gonna let you redo it. How would you describe yourself? Wholesome. <laughs> I really like your earrings. That's the Oh, thank you. Ooh. As soon as you said wholesome, non-toxic. I'm sorry, but I don't believe you. Like, I don't believe you one bit. I'm a wholesome person. I uh, save little kittens uh, every night. I guess something like that would prove that he's a wholesome person, or I don't know. He works with little children as a teacher. I, I don't know, just you gotta say something wholesome. You can't just say, hey, I'm very wholesome. Like, you know? Nice to meet you. You too. Cole he likes to smell his dog. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Here we go. What? Do you, are you like a pet person? I mean, yeah, but like, what do you mean you like to smell your dog? <laughs> so you know how like, if there's someone you really like, you like the smell of them? Yes. I'm the same with my dog. <laughs> okay, like so like smell. you're picking out the shampoos and stuff on purpose to make sure they smell good for you or like... Oh, for my own hair? Or no, for my no, dog? No, 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 for your dog. Fusion. Yeah, no, I mean, just as like... Not even when he shampooed it, like the barber, just, just whatever. What? Just oh. like smell my dog, I guess that's kind of weird. Uh, th this is a mole. This is staged for sure, for sure. There is no way that he's this confused about uh no no, I, I like the I like them without a perfume, with, without shampoo. That is so weird. If this guy is real, you need to lose this uh, interest or never mention it, my dude. Probably the creepiest thing I've heard recently. And I'm not saying it is creepy. But it just sounds creepy when you mention it. Do you have any dogs? But I don't. I used to have a dog. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> she will not let him smell her dog. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. I like your little fit you got going on here. Yeah, I tried a little bit. Okay. okay. Top golf. Do you work at Top Golf? I do. I'm a bartender there. Oh, okay. okay. I usually go to the actual driving ranges, you know, in the okay. area. So you play golf? I do play golf. Oh, okay. Do you play All right. golf? All right. I picked it up when I got to Top Golf. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, we might have to get a swing sometime. Yeah, that'd be Aww. fun. Okay. So, what do you like to do for fun other than golf? So I was a cosmetologist and an esthetician for a little bit. Oh, okay, so you could do hair. Yeah, I can do hair. But I have a question. Mm -hmm. How would your ex, your most recent one, describe you? Oh, we got the ex questions, uh, but I, I gotta notice something. She is taking initiative. She's, uh, you know, doing lots of talking for the first time. She would probably say I'm caring on the bad side. She'd probably say that... She would say I'm controlling, but the only reason uh. why she would say that is because mm -hmm. she uh, posts very explicit pictures on Instagram. Uh -huh. And I was like, you know, I understand that you're happy with your body and I support you. Mm -hmm. But at the same okay. time, can we like dial it back just a little bit? Okay. And she didn't like that. Yeah, interesting. 
I don't know, I, I guess this is a potential deal breaker for some people. I feel like people have really conflicting feelings about this. Some people really don't care while others are, you know, like this guy. Though kind of uh, controlling, is that controlling? Uh, it's debatable. Interesting. What's gonna happen? Wow, you about to hit the button? No, I got scared, I swear. <sighs> oh. To defend her. She didn't press the button. Okay. I didn't, and I've been pressing it. <laughs> I have been Oh, I've been, it. I've been seeing the cycle. Mm -hmm. Do you think you two would be interested? Could be, could be. Date? I'd be interested in going on a second date. Oh, wait, oh really? Really? I too would be interested in going on a second date. Okay. <laughs> you seem like you actually mean it when you say like you're a very caring person. Sometimes you care too much. And you kind of seem like you're really putting yourself out there. Like you're not really holding back. And I really like that. I admire that. Your smile, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Right, so, so, I mean, this is not gonna get ruined now, right? Like, right? Alright, I'm gonna light up one more time. And if why? you don't pass me, you, you know why? Uh, are, are they planning something here? I mean... Ouch. Come on. Why'd you reject me? Hey. I don't know, I just couldn't Staged. get over the little, like... Thing that you were talking about with your ex. I kind of do like to post freely. I don't like anybody to hold me back. That was kind of my it's issue with so my stupid. last relationship. So as much as I like everything else in the conversation and I really wanted it to work, I just don't want to be in another situation where I feel like I'm held it's back. So st stupid. I'm really sorry. It's cool. I get it. I get it. You know. I let her keep posting though. Uh, she won't let me. Uh, I'm, so, I'm sorry. Uh, it happens. Uh, no matches this episode. I'm sorry. The button's disappointed. And she is very disappointed. She literally... Just look at the look on her face. She's like, I'm sorry. I would never change even a little bit for love. I don't know. Maybe she's a little stubborn. Maybe not. Maybe he's controlling. Maybe not. Who knows? We're only seeing what we're seeing, you know? It's just the face of disappointment and the confusion. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to comment, like, share, subscribe, click the bell button to get notified whenever I upload. See you in the next video. Peace out.